Hey everybody, this is Nick Cuenca from TheHyperLoops.com and uh, today I'm doing something a little different. Uh, this is not going to be a Star Wars Destiny video. Um, it's actually going to talk about um, my uh, bachelor party and we had a retro game night and uh, I ended up buying uh, this game which uh, existed in 2002 called uh, NBA Showdown. It uh, This is uh, Tracy McGrady here. I'm a huge basketball fan and I... Uh, wanted to play this during my bachelor party, but we never got around to it. Uh, so in 2000 they made this game called MLB Showdown, which is a baseball sort of, uh, slightly different than this game, but they're sort of, they had a wave of these games. Uh, as, so they had NBA, they had MLB, MLB was the big one, it lasted five years from 2000-2005. They had NFL, they even had an NHL one, uh, NBA Showdown. So NBA Showdown here, they only did 2002. So there aren't that many of these uh, around. Uh, I'm pretty excited. I'm going to open it. I'm going to do a little unboxing. Uh, and uh, yeah, so I just want to talk about that. This is uh, Tracy McGrady, as you know, the legend. Uh, this is the back of this thing. Ready for a little one-on-one. -on -one. Yeah, so I'm ready for a little one-on-one. -on -one. I haven't, I don't actually know how to play this game. So this is, uh, it's made by Wizards of the Coast. It's official license. Look at that logo. Oh, buddy. So yeah, made by Wizards of the Coast. Uh, this only was out for one year, so I'm going to crack it open. I wanted to keep it nice and unopened. Because I know some people really are into, like, the sort of the, the ASMR aspect of uh, unboxing. Uh, you know, for some reason, they like it. And there's a little wrapper, official wrapper. They have the, the, the holographic center here, you know, just the, un the the line of demarcation, if you will. But yeah, so uh, I like these sort of like old games, I like to, you know, buy this. I actually bought this online. Uh, I think there's a few of them, actually. The starters are, are more car common than the actual cards. I was actually interested in trying to get a complete set of this, because I'm a pretty big basketball fan, and I'm a collector of just random things, so I really wanted to look into that and it's actually pretty hard to find some of the cards of this because there was only one set I think it was probably only in first edition so here it is naked with uh, without the plastic you can see it's clearer now so let's just see what's in here I don't actually have no idea what's in here we're, we're taking this voyage together and when they come with a little d20 yeah these games were uh, big into rolling the dice and then you kind of have a and that's a terrible die obviously so we'd probably get our own that doesn't roll twos Almost well, rolling twos is good in this game. I don't really know. And MLB Showdown, I've actually played that a little bit, and uh, it depends on what kind of situations happening. Like uh, you know, rolling high could be good, or rolling high could be bad. So let's see, a little plastic here, so dump it all out. So yeah, these uh, these come with uh, John Stockton and Dikembe Mutombo, uh, and here's a little uh, oh, a nice silver silver package, and here's the little. Uh, Read this first, yeah, so the MLB one I opened it too, and it was very, like, very friendly for, like, young kids that really were into, like, the sport that they that they liked. And this, these are just, I'm pretty sure it's the same thing. It's going to give you, uh, you know, like a basic sort of setup. Um, so, yeah. Um, Alright, so this has a little directions here. We won't read that because that's just going to be boring. So we just, we want to see the cards here. Oh, these are the strategy cards. Look at this. Look at this. Stop! You can't even make that out. Is it? Do I have to? Do I have to peel this off to see? Or did this? Is this just so old that it just faded? Yeah. So it says. It says right here. I can't make it out. It says stop. Do not open. They really wanted you to play the basic game first, which is probably fine to start off with. But anyways, I've played enough CCGs, I could probably handle the, the advanced game. So yeah, so here's score for the quarter. Uh, here's a little, little fill-out thing. Oh, that's cool. Assists. Rebounds. Ooh, alright, we got this. This thing is going to look cool. Oh my goodness, this is going to be huge. Alright, my orientation is not ready for this. Alright, I'm gonna pull this out here. Oh, this is huge! Alright, well, I'm just gonna. I'm gonna tilt the camera. 
All right, so that's quite the that is quite the map there. My goodness, look at that. There's a T Mac right there. Yeah, so that is uh, that is quite the quite the thing. My goodness. So yeah, this is huge. It's got a lot of words on it. I'm not gonna read them to you. We're really just here for the cards, right? If you're clicking on this, you just want to see the cards. And I'm gonna read them out. I actually looked at one of these when I was looking at the MLB show, and I didn't want to. Didn't want to get duplicates of cards, right? So here we got we got John Stockton. Uh, we got Jason Williams. J Will was really good back in the day. Sean Rooks. A center, probably just a crappy big man that was tall. Anthony Carter, I remember Anthony Carter. Greg Buckner. Emmanuel Davis. Pat Garrity, I do remember Pat Garrity. And Ooh, Rick Fox. We all remember Rick Fox from, I think, Stella got her groove back. Oh, buddy. He was an excellent actor. Long acting career after the NBA. Just the man. Imagine that. You're a professional athlete. Get to be an actor. Pretty good life. So that's the Kembe Mutombo. Oh, I love Dikembe. No, no, no. That Jordan finger wag is... One of the best moments ever. When Jordan just jumps on him and he's just like, no, we're not, you're not blocking my shot. So that's Dikembe. 18 power, that's a lot of power. I don't even know this game, I just know that's good. Dale Davis. All right, Dale, I remember Dale Davis. Ooh, Jermaine O'Neal before he stunk. All right, Michael Dickerson. Mark Jackson, who is, was a coach. Now he's a commentator. Not a great commentator, not my favorite. He's okay. Ooh, Mitch Richmond, man, that's like it's old Rich Mitch Richmond when he was like ring chasing with the Lakers. And Robert Ory. Oh, that's cool. Robert Ory is uh He was good. He was good, good uh good sixth sixth man. Uh, he actually has six championship rings, I believe. And Lafonso Ellis. So, there you have it, guys. That is uh, NBA Showdown. Um, if, if people want me to, like, play this game and record it, I, I would. But, I don't know. This only lasted for a year. I can't imagine it's very good. Oh, yeah, the strategy cards. How could I forget? I'm not supposed to open this. I'm breaking the rules, guys. I'm breaking them. i got to get to these cards. I'm going to try to keep them in order because I think these are sort of teams. Alright. Quick feet. Right. Man, these are a lot of strategy cards. I, guess. I think these are strategy cards. That's what they're called in the MLB Showdown. Alright. Quick feet. Imagine the camera there. Quick feet. This player gets plus four speed on defense. It's got to be the shoes. I found that the flavor text in the in MLB and this game are pretty pretty hilarious. Um, God, I wish I wish this about okay. All right, so good D. This player gets plus two speed and plus two power on defense. Defense wins championships. That's what it says. Yeah, my focus is out of whack, yo. Don't like that. Turnover. If the opposing player has any cold markers, draw two cards. Even good players make mistakes. Change in strategy. Draw two cards and then discard two. You may play an additional card on this player. They've seen it all and they know how to beat it all. It's, a, it's a Malone and Stockton. They never could beat... Uh, Michael Jordan. So that's a, that's a bad flavor text. That's flavor fail right there, actually. Um, quick feet. We've already seen that one. Good D. Already saw that one. Taking the charge. If this player has more speed than the opposing player, roll a die. 1 through 11, no effect. 12 through 20, the opposing player gets minus 2 points 
on his scoring roll, but not less than zero. Very important. And the opposing team loses one assist. If any, if any, take one for the team. That's the charge, baby. Defensive stopper. Yeah, that's Matumbo right there. You yes, see, was. Uh, if this player was on the bench last quarter, he gets plus five speed and plus five power on defense. Wow, Dikembe Mutombo is the first four-time recipient of the NBA Defensive Player of the Year award. Fun fact. I don't know if that's changed since 2002. Rejected. That's a picture of Tim Duncan blocking uh, Dirk Nowitzki. If this player has power 14 or more, the opposing player gets a minus two points on his scoring roll, but not less than zero. Tim Duncan has one of the best all-around games in the NBA. If you take it to the hole, you would better know where he is. He was very good. I don't think he was like the best shot blocker, but he could he could block shots. He was tall. He's like 70 tall. Pick his pocket. If this player has more speed than the opposing player, the opposing team loses one assist, if any. Don't get caught looking at the apple in case someone takes the ladder away. Uh, Lenny Wilkins said that. Uh, that's Steve Francis, and I believe, uh, I don't know who that person is stealing the ball from him. I can't recognize him. All right, run and gun. This is their offense card now. These were defensive cards that were gray. So, run and gun. This player scores two points, and your team loses one assist, if any. Sometimes you have to ride a hot player. Wow, that's, that is, uh, that's very uh, sexual. It's very sexual indeed. All right. Find the open man. Oh, that's Carmelo. Assisting. If the opposing player is double teaming someone else, this player gets plus four to his scoring roll. That's the price you pay. And one. This player scores one point. Finish strong. That card seems good. I don't know. I don't know it's game at all, but just a card that just scores points is good. He's heating up. That's Allen Iverson. Roll a die. 1 through 15. No effect. All right. This card seems terrible. 16 to 20. This player gets a hot marker. He's in a special place. That, that special place is retired. All right. Scrapping in the paint. Roll a die. 1 through 10. This player gets a minus 1 rebound on a scoring roll, but not less than 0. 11 through 20, this player gets plus 2 rebounds on his scoring roll. It's all about who wants it the most. That's right. It is. Double foul. Your opponent chooses one of his or her players, and that player takes one foul shot. If he misses, he gets a cold marker. Peyton and Malone play to win. And one. Player scores one point. Cool. He's heating up. Scrapping in the paint. And ooh, brute force. Oh, with Shaq. Shaq daddy. If this player hits a dunk, so it has the classification of a dunk, uh, which uh, is Shaq dunking the ball. And uh, it says, if this player has power 15 or more, discard up to three other cards from your hand to have him score twice that many points. Be careful, those backboards are expensive. Yeah. All right, let's see this other one. Ooh, I got, we got a fresh card here. I'm worried that these are gonna be duplicates, but whatever. Killer crossover. Roll a die. 1 through 18. No effect. All right. <laughs> uh, 9 through 20. This player gets a hot marker, and the opposing player gets a cold marker. Francis breaks left. He breaks right, and then he breaks your ankles. Oh, man. That's so sweet. That, that flavor text right there just really makes it. Clean the glass. Timmy D. This player gets plus one rebound on his scoring roll. Tim Duncan is one of the league's leading window washers. Maybe when he was younger. A power move. This player gets plus two power on offense. 
it's all about location. Yeah, I guess that's that's true. Time out. This player gets plus one speed and plus one power and offense. Get a T.O., baby. <laughs> Starting the fast break. If this player gets any rebounds on his scoring roll, he may trade one of them for two assists. This man, this game sounds somewhat more complicated than MLB Showdown. The fast break starts on defense and usually ends in a high percent shot. Clean the glass again. Timmy D. Power move again. Timeout. Ooh, all right, we got Tomahawk Dunk. Discard a card to play Tomahawk Dunk. This player scores two points. Roll a die. 1 through 19, no effect. 20. Give each of your players a hot marker. Fear this. So, yeah, this card uh, is, uh, is is something else. It's got it's got a cool picture of Kobe. Um, it is a dunk, so that's important to note. Dunk. Slam dunk. I wonder if that's a dunk. It is a dunk. If this player has at least four more power than the opposing player, he scores two points. When the Derek Anderson goes up. He must come down eventually. Ooh, Paul Pierce. All right, here's some defense cards. Get the crowd in it. Roll a die. One through six, no effect. Seven through 20, okay. We got one that's like better than 50-50. This player gets plus two speed and plus two power on defense. If the original roll was 19 through 20, this player gets a hot marker. All right, so that's cool. Feed off the crowd. He's the truth. All right. Good D. This player gets plus two speed and plus two power on the defense. All right. I think we saw that switching strategies with Grant. And it says if this player has less speed and less power than the opposing player, draw three cards. And then discard two of your choice. A good strategy can give a team the edge. All right, tough shot. The opposing player gets minus three points on his scoring roll, but not less than zero, and gets plus one rebounds on his scoring roll. Kenya Martin is a great scorer, but sometimes even the best scorers find themselves between a rock and a hard place. Sorry, I'm going off center here. Yeah, sorry it's blurry, guys. It's just... Er. Defense. Defense. For the rest of the quarter, all of your players get plus two speed and plus two power on defense. But minus two speed and minus two power on offense. Hmm. That's interesting. I don't know what that means, but it's certainly a big effect. Good D. Yeah, we already saw this one, but I'm trying to... Like, Alright, let's see here. Switching strategies. I already saw that. Tough shot. I already saw that. Ooh, alright. Anticipate the pass. That's Steve Francis right there. A.K.A. Stevie Franchise. If the opposing team has six or more assists, it loses two of them. Steve Franchise... Steve, Stevie Franchise plays the passing lanes as well as anyone. Yeah. You know, he had a really tough end of his career. I think it was injuries. And good D. All right, well, there it is. If you stayed uh, through this, then, uh, you know, on you. Good on you, mate. Uh, I made this video because uh, I actually went looking on, uh, here's the, the book. I went looking on uh, on YouTube to see if there was anything, so, and there was nothing. No one had done this video. So I know if you're subscribed to our channel, you're not, uh, this is generally not something you watch, but if you enjoyed it and you aren't subscribed, I might do this sort of thing uh, with, uh, you know, weird games like this that uh, are sort of forgotten, forgotten little gems. And, uh, yeah, if, uh, please uh, like and subscribe. And, uh, as always... May the roll...
damn it, just a five. Be with you. 